here we go with part three. It is now the camera's turn. A two. And our 12 all play of the game. One, two. 12 all plays, nine my plays. We never had the all plays revolve back to the other ones yet in any of these bonus disc games. Alright, so Spellbinder, identify the movie. I mean, we could have some with these all play to wins. Live and let die. Alright. So that was our 12 all plays. So now we have 12 all plays, 9 my plays. Popcorn. Ooh, can't move. Back to the film reel. Can't move. Ticket. One. And a star. We did an all plus. Now it's a trivia card. One. It'll be a pop culture. Who are the only mother and daughter ever nominated for Oscars in the same film? Laura Dern and Diane Ladd in Rambling Rose. Mm. Film take. Oh, that's right. If they're on that spot, they can move in. So, second all play to win, and our 13th all play in total. So, 13 all plays, 9 my plays, and our second all play to win of the game. Alright, who am I? Name another character. I come from down south. I'm a special agent. I'm hunting Buffalo Bill. I'll pass on the Chianti. Dang it. Ah, Clary Starling, The Silence of the Lambs. Well, final cut. For the film take. Camera also moves, moves to that spot. So our third all play to win, our 14th all play in total. So 14 all plays, nine my plays, third all play to win. It's got a credit roll. Then a movie from the credits. All right, write it for it, based on nothing lasts forever. Directed by John McTiernan. Tierney. Hostage, Rebecca Bruce Hard. That's my last name, Bruce Hard. Sergeant Al Powell, Reginald Bill Johnson. Hans Gruber, Alan Rickman. Bruce Willis, John McLean. Die Hard. Oh, wow. I finally got a credit roll right. And then all play to win, so I was lucky. So, camera will get second. And this is part three. We're winding it down. Let's see. Popcorn. One. A buzz card. One. Your new movie just scored the biggest box office opening weekend ever. Move ahead three spaces while you count your dough. Oh, that's going to be an all play to win. One, two, three. So, our fourth all play to win and our 15th all play to win. 15th all play. So, 15 all plays, 9 my plays, 4 fall play to win. And it's a visual puzzler, it's done by the movie. Alright, what do we have in this one? Ah, dang it. I'm gonna make a guess. Beverly Hills Cop. Aw, oh, Dragnet. Dang it. Had to make a guess there. I was thinking of something. Alright, ring three for him, too. Film reel. Can't move. Ticket. Alright. 
One, two, three. Sixteenth all play and our fifth all play to win. We haven't had an all play count get to twenty in a quite a while. So sixteenth all play, sixteen all plays, nine my plays, and fifth all play to win. Another name to character for who am I? All right, I'm from Detroit. Victor Maitland is my target. One of my favorite weapons is a banana. A banana? I'm not welcome in Beverly Hills. Uh, it's the Beverly Hills cop guy. I'll at least count that as r somewhat right. Yeah, Axel Foley. Beverly Hills cop. I kind of said Beverly Hills cop. I have some in reference to it, so I'm going to say I got it. Could have been possibly thinking of the name, too, so. That might lead to some stuff, but I'm, I at least got Beverly Hills Cop guy or something. Film take. First final cut of the game. Then it will be the... Popcorn. Uh, who played Shaft in the 2000 movie? I don't know. Then it'll be the popcorn who's also in Ring 3. And then it's back to the film man, who's not even up to the all play to win yet. Samuel L. Jackson. Oh man. I haven't seen it really, so I didn't, didn't wasn't able to get that. Alright, so film take moves to Ring 2. Now it's the popcorn, also in Ring 3. So we'll have at least one more my play. So we will finish this game possibly with 17 my plays. Unless we get one beforehand, it's possible. But at most, we could get 17. All right, who starters Private Eye JJ gets in both Chinatown and the Two Jakes? I don't know that one either. The Final Cut ones may not be easy. Jack Nicholson. Oh, it was Jack Nicholson. Dang it. Now it's the film reel. One. Let's start. We did a trivia card, so now it's a buzz card. One. The new movie is such a big hit that you were able to get your Lakers seats upgraded. Right down in the front row. Hey, Jack, give me some popcorn while you're up. Move ahead three spaces. We never got that buzz card before. That's going to lead to all play to win, so one, two, three. So, yep. We finished this game with 17 all plays. So the final all play of the game, and the final all play to win. We won't get any more my plays, so we'll finish with nine my plays. 17 all plays, nine my plays. And pectograms. Alright, let's get this. Movie title. Tango and cash? Or tango and money? Oh, Tango and Cash, alright. We'll accept that. Alright. So, Film Reel will get fourth. Unlike the last two games at one. So, we're down to the final two pieces. So, it'll be Film Takes turns. So we do final cuts the rest of this. We'll see if we can end this in three parts. And both pieces left are in ring two now. What was the first James Bond film to feature a villain named Jaws? Oh, that was, um, The Spy Who Loved Me. Yep. Alright. So we got two questions, so here's the other one. What James Bond film featured a villain named Scaramanga? The Man with the Golden Gun. Oh, that was easy. We didn't need trivia card for that one. We actually got the on-screen ones, finally. I've seen the movies quite a bunch of times, so it's kind of good to get Bond questions. And that's why Bond's seen it's got some things. I may have some flaws in that game. May not get all of them right. But I'll, I'll still get quite a bunch of them right. Just like I do on the, um... 
Just like I do on Seen It Junior and um the regular disc of Seen It Movie Deluxe. The regular disc with the six games we did. So got him moved. He'll get fifth. Alright. We're down to one piece though. The popcorn. We'll get last place in this one. See if we can end this on three parts. Is also in ring two. Name the 1992 movie in which Robert Redford leads a covert team of computer security experts. Ah, this one. I might not get that one though. Sneakers. Nope. Move from the ring one. This is it. We can either end at this part or we go to part four if we keep getting them wrong. See if we can make this the last one and end this in three parts. What is Dirty Harry's last name? Oh, crap. Oh my god. The last name, I never heard it. Callahan. Okay. Alright, so we gotta do it again. Let's see if we can actually get the on screen ones before it goes to the trivia card ones. If we do that, that'd be an achievement. Right there. But they don't have the picture ones for Final Cut either, like the regular disc. Alright, what film features Clint Eastwood as a 1930s cop named Lieutenant Spear? Dang it. City Heat. But yeah, on the regular disc of Seen It movie, they actually had picture ones for the final cuts. Not on this disc, though. Just like they also left out sound clips for this one. For the bonus disc. They don't have it in any of them. That's from what I looked at. Alright, see if we can get this one. Funeral in Berlin is a sequel to what classic British spy film? Thing. The Epcrest file. Some kind of name. Now we're running a little bit of time here. So we gotta hurry up and get this. Who played Popeye Doyle in the French Connection? Dang it. Really? They want to do this to me? Gene Hackman. Well, this is how it's going to be for now. Final Cut Ring 1 until we get this right. It's possibly going to lead to a fourth part if we don't get it in time. 4 15 minutes or something. Oh, trivia card. Come on, give me a trivia card. Hurry. Come on, let's go. A pop culture. What was the first fully computer generated fully feature film? Toy Story. And that helped us. So we've done it. And that's the end of game three. Tomorrow, I'll do the final game. Won the game. So I'll move him there. Only three parts. This was easier than romance. I don't know how many parts comedy took. It might have took at least four parts because some of them. Like part two and three of that, I had to split in a separate segment things because the film, because it said the video was too long, and I first upload the whole, tried to upload the whole thing, so we couldn't do it. You are a winner. 
All right, that's the end of the Cop Spies and Private Eyes round. Uh, Star is one, so tomorrow we'll do the final game of the Scenic Movie Deluxe series, the sci-fi round, so see you guys for that.